Hey guys, what's up? Jimmy here with another Lots of Games video. Thank you so much for stopping by, uh, checking out my latest video. First and foremost, I want to apologize for not uploading more. Um, we recently got into our, our own place. I can't believe it's been almost four months. Uh, you know, I live in Napa. I can't believe it's almost been four months since my house burned down. We we're able to get a place. I'm hoping to do like a house tour soon. It's a, a really little small place, but it's, it's nice. It's a place we can call home. I'm really grateful for it. Uh, so I want to apologize for not uploading more, just kind of getting established, getting our own place, getting kind of things together. Um, you can see behind me, um, I've got a couple of shelves that I was able to set up. So I'm pretty stoked about that. Pretty happy about that. Um, and uh, a few guys, a few of you guys have sent me some things. I want to do a uh, this video update video because I'm super excited. A couple big packages. Also, a coworker a little while back, a guy I used to work with, he had a bunch of old Nintendo and Sega games. I'm going to get to that last. But if you guys like these types of videos, definitely make sure to hit that thumbs up button. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, uh, now, one of my last videos, a uh, guy by the name of Juan, uh, super, super generous. He sent me some games. Uh, you guys might have seen that in one of my last videos that I did. Well, he sent me uh, for the PS4, uh, The Evil Within 2. Uh, and he said on how, hey, Jimmy, this is a really good game. You should definitely do a video on this or talk about it. He said it looks really amazing. I have not played this one. Uh, but I've heard some really great things, great reviews. A lot of gamers really enjoy this. I have, did, have never played it, but I've heard great things about it. So thank you so much, Juan. Now Juan, you know, he sent this to me. It came, it was individually uh, in a single package. He sent it, I believe it was from Amazon. And then he was like, uh, hey, Jimmy, send me another message. Hey, Jimmy, I've got some games in my house lying around. I wanted to send these to you. So he sent me this, this, big box and so I want to just open it and show you guys what's inside um it was actually double boxed very uh <laughs> this guy knows how to send games um and there is a lot of stuff um so Juan again thank you so much for your extreme generosity um uh, some of the games that are that are here uh I lost in the fire so this is really really something special um let's see here First and foremost, let's go over some PlayStation 4 games. I got uh, Deus Ex Mankind Divided. Great game. Uh, this is one that burned in the fire. The Division. Uh, this is one I did not have for the PlayStation 4. Skyrim. Uh, this is one I did lose in the fire. Metal Gear Solid 5. The Phantom Pain. And, uh... So though I, it might be, so yeah. So those are the those are the PS4 games. Awesome. Thank you so so very much. Uh, and also, Juan also included some um, actually a decent amount of Xbox One games, uh, which is amazing because I don't really have a whole lot of Xbox One games. Uh, I do have an Xbox One that uh, someone had given to me. I think they won an Xbox One for me. It was like a this is kind of silly, but crazy, but a contest on Facebook, a friend of mine entered it and actually won. They ended up giving the Xbox One to me. Super, super cool. Okay, uh, Gears of War Ultimate Edition. Great game. This is one I actually, I do not have. Overwatch. I do not have that one. Uh, Elder Scrolls Online. Gears of War 4. Let's see here. Halo 5. This is one I, I lost in the fire. Uh, Battlefront. Uh, Ghost Recon Wildlands. This is a great one. It's a great game. And GTA 5. Do not have that one. Doom. Great, great game. Uh, Dying Light. I had this one on the PS4. Loved it. Glad to have it again. Let's see here. Um, uh, I've actually never heard of this one. Uh, Fair, uh, Onik. I've, I've never heard of this one, ever. If you guys play this one, let me know in the comment section below. Finally, for the Xbox One, this is a great game. 
This is Bullet Storm. I had this one. Uh, I have this actually on PC, but I think I did have it on the 360. It burned in the fire, but now I've got the one on the Xbox One. Super stoked to have it uh, in my Xbox One collection. So those are some those are some great Xbox One games. Some of those I've never played or I never had. So that's awesome. Thank you. Uh, then we got uh, in this box one also sent some PlayStation 3 games, uh, which is great because I had a lot of great PS3 games that unfortunately they're they're no more. Uh, Disgaea 3. Disgaea 4. Have here, this is a good one. Uh, Darkness 2. It's like a really like a horror first person shooter. And Puppeteer. I have played this one, but I, I've never I never owned it. And then Virtual Fighter 5. Love this one. I love Virtual Fighter 5. It's, it's amazing. And finally, Juan included in this box some really great uh, Nintendo Wii games. Uh, let's see here. Actually, I've never played this one. I'm not sure about this one. Zack and Wiki. I think that one might be good. I'm not sure. Wario Land Shake It. I was starting to build up my Wii collection, some of the choice ones, and I was so bummed to lose those in the fire. This is a good one. Donkey Kong Country Returns. Love that one. Uh, New Super Mario Bros. Wii. That's a good one. That's a fun co-op game. <sighs> I love these games. Su Super Mario Galaxy. Love that one. I was about halfway through it. I was playing it, actually. And, you know, and uh, so more. Uh, Super Mario Galaxy 2. Great one. And finally for the Wii, uh, Super Smash Bros. Brawl. One. Thank you so much. Some amazing PS4 games, PS3 games, uh, Xbox One games, and Nintendo Wii games. Thank you so very, very much. Wow, that's super, super generous. Okay, um, oh yeah, there's another one that I wanted to show you guys. Uh, I got recently in the mail um, a package from Alex, and Alex included a note He says, hello, lots of games, Proto Luigi again. That's right. This is this is Proto Luigi. He had sent me something in the past. I uh, says, I see that you are doing well so far. Here are some more games I may not need since our family is moving in a few months. I thought that these games may need a proper home, so I am handing it to you. <laughs> Love your optimism, and I hope you have a great day. Sincerely, Proto Luigi. Uh, P.S. Congrats on getting 100,000 subscribers. Thank you so much, Proto Luigi. Uh, on the back front of the package, Alex, now I definitely know who you are. Uh, thank you so much, Proto Luigi. Uh, got here, wrap. Some PS3 games, awesome. We have here uh, Soul Calibur 4. In Super Street Fighter 4. I love I love Street Fighter 4. Let's see here. One more bundle of games here. Got here. Need for Speed Undercover on the PS2. Lego City Undercover on the Wii U. You know what? I had just gotten this. I had gotten a Wii U. Uh, someone had sent me a Wii U in... March of 2017, and I was getting a really sweet collection for the Wii U. I had um, Bayonetta 2, a Donkey Kong uh, Tropical Freeze, um, I even had Zelda Breath of the Wild on the Wii U. I'm really bummed that I lost all those Wii U games in the fire. Super bummed. Honestly, I probably had a stack of like 15, 20 really good Wii U games, and I was... <sighs> anyway, it's okay. Games can be replaced. It's okay. I was just bummed to lose all this stuff because I was really starting to get a good collection and play some of those fun games. Uh, Sonic Colors on the Wii. Uh, Tony Hawk's Downhill Jam. And then finally, for the PC, Star Wars uh, 2, or the Star Wars Original Trilogy 2. So thank you so much, Proto Luigi. That is very, very kind of you. Um, Finally, the final thing I wanted to show you guys is um, my coworker a little while back, I haven't done a video about this, but coworker, a guy I used to work with, 
he heard about the fire and he came up. He actually, um, so this is like a few days after the fire. Things were still smoking in Napa. He came up and he actually came up with some games and he actually, it was just so kind of him. He came up, he had coworkers at his job and he actually asked from, for some like money donations that people chipped in and helped out so I can help get back on my feet, help get my own place. And it was super generous of him to do that. Um, and so with, you know, his, he had some money in an envelope he gave to me uh, after he found out that I lost everything in the fire. And he's like, oh yeah, I've got some games in my trunk. I'm not sure if you're interested in those. And I'm like, I would be definitely interested in those. So today I wanted to share with you guys what uh, was given to me. Uh, let's go ahead and start things off. One of the first things that he included was a, uh, Get a few boxes here. This is in a Vans box, and this is a um, an NES dust cover. Kind of give you a hint of some of the stuff I'm going to be going over with you. Uh, first up, we have here Life Force for the NES, Super Mario Brothers Three, complete in box. Uh, this is what we never played before. And MTV Remote Control. This is like a game show on MTV called Remote Control. Um, Kari Warriors. I had a lot of fun with that growing up. Let's just sure if you can see that. The Karate Kid for the NES. And then in this box, finally in this box, we have a box copy of Goonies 2. Pretty awesome, pretty, pretty cool. Don't wanna hit the tripod there. Um, next up, another shoe box, a, a fancy floral shoe box. Have here, Jeopardy, Super Mario Brothers and Duck Hunt. This one I've never heard before, Eliminator uh, Boat Duel. Classic Tetris. And then, Paperboy, Paperboy 2. I don't think I ever played Paperboy 2. Let's see here. We have here, I've never heard of this one. This is a Max 15 game cartridge. I don't know if you guys can see that okay. 15 game cartridge. Um, Yoshi. I think this was one of the last NES games. Correct me if I'm wrong on that, guys. Yoshi, is that one of the... Another copy of Super Mario Brothers Duck Hunt. You can never have too many copies of that. Just in case one of them's not working right. Like, guys, so many times I can blow on this. Let's put another one. Tiny Toon Adventures. I have played this one. And then here we have Lemmings. I remember playing Lemmings. That was, that was a lot of fun. Okay, so finally, also um, what was given to me among those games was my coworker had given me as uh, this huge, this really heavy box of really good stuff. Uh, show you guys. Uh, first and foremost is the include gave me an NES system. And then also what would be complete for that, uh, either a Master System or a Sega Genesis. And then he included also a couple controllers. Um, one of them, actually both of them I'll, I'll show you. It's these, pretty cool. They've got like turbo switches on them. They're like third party Sega Genesis controllers. So they've got like turbo switches, kind of similar of the turbo switches for the TurboGrafx-16. I always like that option. I know that a lot of con controllers today, they don't give you like a turbo option. But uh, let's see here. For the Sega Genesis, this is one I played in the arcades, Cyberball. I'm not sure how good the port is on the, on the Genesis. Uh, Blades of Steel. I had two copies of this that <laughs> burned in the fire. I love Blades of Steel. Played a whole bunch of that. Um, got some loose Genesis games. Of course, we have Sonic the Hedgehog, Jurassic Park, um, Sonic Spinball, and then. <laughs> This is the Joe Montana. This is uh, NFL Football 94 starring Joe Montana. Joe Montana Football. I believe that was a Sega Genesis exclusive. I don't think the Joe Montana Football was on a Nintendo console, but I could be wrong. Um, let's see here. Some more Genesis games. We've got here Mutant League Hockey. 
and uh, NHL 96. NHL 98. And then finally for the Genesis, we have here the Lone Ranger, which I don't think I ever played this one on the Genesis. Finally, in addition to all the cords and cables and NES controllers, I also got some, uh, some more um, NES games. So I'll go over that with you guys. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oh my goodness. Final Fantasy. Got here. Tech Mobile. Love Tech Mobile. It's Smash TV. I forgot they had an NES version. I just remember Smash TV on the Super Nintendo. I had a lot of fun with Smash TV in the arcades. SNK Baseball Stars. Of course, there was Baseball Stars for the Neo Geo and Baseball Stars 2 for the Neo Geo, but they also had Baseball Stars on the NES. Rad Racer. And correct me if I'm wrong, guys, but I believe Rad Racer is a game that you could use 3D glasses with. Like, it had a mode where you could use just, you know, like the paper 3D glasses. That was a um, Nintendo exclusive. Top Secret Episode uh, Golgo 13, if I'm saying that right. This is one that I played a bunch as a kid. Arch Rivals. And then finally, Snake, Rattle, and Roll. So definitely a huge thank you to everyone that donated these games to help me kind of start my collection again after the fires in Napa. Guys, your support is so much appreciated. Thank you so very much. Look for more videos in the near future. Um, I've been playing a bunch of uh, Monster Hunter World and also um, Final Fantasy Disgaea. And I'll be doing a video or two about those in the near future. But as always, guys, thanks so much for watching, and I'll catch you later.